We have a question from Patrick, and Patrick asks uh, an interesting question. Is there value in, in learning the kettlebell sports movements? That is the snatch and clean and jerk long cycle. Obviously, these are different from hard style movements. Uh, kettlebells seem to favor efficiency, whereas um, the kettlebell sports style is efficiency versus hard style emphasizes power. Is there any value in learning these more efficient movement patterns? For argument, say this person does not compete in kettlebell sport and doesn't plan to, but wants to train for general. Well, you're, you're asking a ton of questions here, and, and they all come down to some simple, simple points. Is there value in learning that technique? Well, you know, I competed in GS twice. Uh, it's an interesting sport. Uh, when I talk to people who are from that area of the world, they tell you they they tell me that it's really, really a minor, minor sport. And I know that a lot of people listening to me are kettlebell enthusiasts. So when I say that on you know and be totally honest about it, it's going to upset some people. But it's an extremely minor sport. Um, uh, Olympic lifting is far more popular in those areas when we talk about lifting and, of course, powerlifting. And then there's the, the, the bodybuilding world. Um, is there value in learning those techniques? Well, I think there's value if you're an instructor uh, to, to understand them, to be able to say, okay, this is this and this is that and understand. And it seems like already, Patrick, you understand uh, the value of both sides. Um I have some friends who take uh, uh, the sport very seriously, and uh, I actually learn a lot from them. Uh, is there a lot of carryover from kettlebell sport into other sports? Not from what I've seen. You, you know, one thing you, because you become so efficient, your body adapts into that, which is fine. But it, there's not going to be a, so your body's going to adapt into the sport. But there's not going to be a lot of carryover for like a triple jumper or a pole vaulter or whatever discus star so is there value in understanding it knowing it seeing it yes uh how serious you have to take it that's gonna be up to you okay